Hey guys, back here again here. Shot shows going on in Vegas. Some really cool looking stuff that's coming out. I want to just shine a light on. Other channels is done. I've seen American Air Gunner. They're showing some of this. That's where I got a lot of my information from. But I don't know if any of you guys are subscribed to that channel. If not, you know, go check them out. You know, they do a lot of cool stuff on there. But I want to show you some still pictures from their page and. uh Stuff I'm really interested in. I mean, Umrek has got an air rifle that's coming out that shoots arrows at a really, really cheap price. It takes like 170 bucks. It runs on either an 88 gram big CO2 or you can buy their adapter that does the 212 grams. So, I mean, it's really accessible to people. And uh, I said Hudson, they got a full auto 30 caliber pellet rifle. This thing looks sick. So I want to show you that in the video. And then they also got a 50 caliber that's coming out that shoots 800 foot pounds. That's crazy too. But I just want to do a video showing you guys this stuff so far that I've seen that looks interesting to me. You know, there's going to be more news coming up sometime this week. You know, probably even more stuff that's going to look really cool. But these are the three things that caught my eye from SHOT Show. And I'm like, man, I would I'd really like to get one of these. Especially that full auto 30 caliber. That's crazy. But I'm also really interested in that... Uh, the air gun that shoots the the arrows it's not the air saber i'll show you in the video it's that was an air javelin i think is what they're calling it it's 170 dollars retail is what they're saying and it, you know it runs off 12 gram co2s if you buy the adapter so i mean that's accessible for anyone 88 grams you know those things are expensive and they're a little bit harder to find if you're just going to stores trying to buy them but everywhere has 12 gram co2s so you know it's really accessible to anyone i thought so I want to show you guys that and you know, I'll show you some pictures and I'll talk about them in the picture and I'll let you guys know what's going on and if I see any more SHOT Show news that really catches my eye, I'll make another video. So here we go guys. Alright guys, we're going to be starting with the 30 caliber full auto Hotson Blitz. This thing reminds me of a FAMAS rifle, the, just, you know, the shape of it. really think it's a good looking rifle and having full auto capabilities, that's pretty cool on 30 caliber. I don't think that's ever been done yet. Another thing you notice is that magazine, almost like a pellet tin. <laughs> thing is really huge. But, uh, you know, it's got to be pretty big to house 30 caliber uh, shells. Or pellets, I don't want to call them shells. The pellets. That's another picture, a side view of it. Like I said, it looks like a FAMAS rifle. Pretty cool looking. I like the shape of it. Really interested in this thing. The only thing is a little bit of downside is it's going to be $999. But, I mean, for full auto, shooting 30 caliber, it's not too bad of a price. So you can see there is the uh the big old <laughs> that big old pellet tin shaped uh magazine there. Thing's huge. But uh it's gotta be big, you know, to house all those giant pellets. <laughs> Another view of it. I, I don't I really like the shape of it. It looks pretty good. Pretty pretty stoked about that. The air javelin, this is another one I'm really, really interested in because uh the price point is $170. I mean, that's that's pretty dang cheap, and you can run this thing on an 88 gram CO2, or if you have the uh, it's like a conversion thing you can buy from them where you can put it in there and you could do two 12 grams, which I'd be interested in that. So don't have to go out and buy those really expensive 88 gram CO2s. You just get that little conversion thing, and you can run two two 12 CO2 uh, cartridges down here, and uh, I'll show you in a second where it pulls off. But yeah, I don't know if you see my very first video where I'm uh, shooting the uh, Sportsman 900 from Bear River. Kind of looks like that. Like this, the 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 shape of it kind of reminds me of that. So let's see here. Go to the next next picture. It's just the box that comes in. It's supposed to come with three arrows. I think they're saying over 300 feet per second. So you might be able to take out a little small game with it. I wouldn't try to hunt with it because it's not going to shoot hard enough. But uh, for just running on CO2, and you can do a lot of fun stuff. You can play darts. <laughs> <laughs> do air gun darts with this, make a big old dart board. And it does stick in, you know, archery targets, so it's been stated that it does that. Here's a picture, you know, they're taking off the uh the bottom part where you put in the CO two here. Like I said, eighty eight grams or you can get the conversion little thing where you plug into it and you could do two twelve gram CO twos. So that's probably what I'll be doing. I, I'm really interested in maybe getting one of these pretty neat now this thing is crazy. This is the Hudson Pal Driver. This thing is supposed to shoot over 800 feet feet or foot pounds of energy. I can't talk right. Foot pounds of energy. This thing is going to be a big game hunting PCP rifle. It's 50 caliber. So I mean, <laughs> you're going to be able to take down anything you want with that pretty much in North America. You know, it's 
it's no joke and I think they said that's supposed to already be out in retail stores or they're sending them to distribution stores I think that's what they said in the video I have to you know I'll leave the links to all the videos down below if this is from the American Air Gunners page that's where these pictures are coming from that I've cropped and stuff but I'll leave I'll leave a link in the description so you can you know watch the video for these things and uh going back to the uh, air javelin the uh, American air gunner channel they're doing a giveaway on one of these so I'll leave the link in the description for that too so you know you can enter in and possibly win one of these so I mean what do you got to lose you know got to be in it to win it just want to do a little video here showing what I've been interested in so far shot show 2020 and uh you know if anything else pops up that really catches my eye you know I'll do a part two of this video if anything's amazing and I'm like wow that's awesome so catch you guys on the next one and hopefully I'll get a review up soon but this weather's been really cold out my way so hopefully it warms up but I think they're said to snow tomorrow so guess we'll see <laughs>